creation and in this video I would like to share with you my pineapple plant. It's a pineapple top that I got from a pineapple fruit that is now called a pineapple plant because there's roots forming below which is really awesome and I will show you those roots shortly. Now I know you've probably seen a lot of videos of people growing pineapple tops in a container with soil and it works and you know I wanted to do something different so my method is a container with water and I've proven it to work because roots have formed below. Now I made a video of this pineapple plant amongst other things I was growing indoors. I uploaded that video I believe October 7th and I will post a link of that video somewhere along here so you can check it out and see compare those two things and this plant is doing great. Now, I've been thinking whether to uh, transplant it in a container with soil or just leave it alone in a container with water. And I finally came to a conclusion that I am going to leave it in a container with water and to see how far it will grow or will the roots get bigger. I just want to see also the roots at the bottom. You know, it's really interesting. You, most people only see the top part working and it's great, but for this thing, I'm really intrigued at the bottom to see the pineapple roots, how well it's going to form and all that stuff. And oh, one thing I do want to share too is that when people plant their pineapple in container with soil, um, the top leaf starts to turn brown, the, um, the leaves starts to wilt or droop or you just look sick and they don't know what's happening because they just, you know, they just cut it off from a, a fruit and planted it and not knowing what's going on there. But the cool thing with the water container method is that I can see that roots are forming so I know this plant is healthy and it's going to survive. So far, hopefully, keeping my fingers crossed. Now also, see this part right here? I don't know if you can see these uh, cuttings. These leaves, I cut them out to show you that these were the old leaves and these right here are the new leaves. Look at that, they're all green and there's a lot of leaves forming down there. So you know the water container method really works. So if you wanna give it a try, go ahead and let me know if you're going to give it a try because it's pretty neat to just to see roots. Can you see the roots down there? Isn't it awesome looking? I think it is just really cool. So. I'll probably just get another pineapple fruit and cut the pineapple top and transplant that um, in a container with soil just to see, you know, that one will work as well. And I'll make a video of that when I do that. But for now, this is something I want to share with you because I think it's super awesome that the roots are formed and uh, new leaves are forming in top. So let's go ahead and move you closer so you can get a better look. So here is my pineapple plant. I decided to do the recording outside where there is natural light so hopefully you can see it better and also I am using an HD feature on this camera um, for this portion of the video so hopefully that helps you take a better look get a better look of this plant as well now as you can see on the very top those are new set of leaves forming in there which is super cool so that um, tells you that this plant is growing and thriving and I don't have to wonder because also knowing that I can see the roots, look at that, that's the centerpiece right there, look at all those roots. And seeing the roots coming up, no, I know that this plant is going to survive for me which is really awesome. And as you can see in color, the very ends of the roots are white, that means those are new growth. So it's constantly growing. Um, the roots are constantly growing and uh, I think new roots are forming on the side which is really awesome. So in this container I don't exchange the water, I don't throw the water out and put new water. All I've been actually doing is adding more and more water. So it likes the water and so far it's good and I don't want to create any kind of shock or stress by um, you know just putting whole new different water. I'm just adding water on this uh, container and I will continue to keep it in this container until the roots just get too much, it's just uh, too crowded in there, then I will use another container, a bigger container with water and continue to grow this plant in water container. Now I know uh, pineapples, they don't fruit within a year or two or even max to three years, 
but uh, I can wait. <laughs> I'm not in a hurry. I just want to see if um, this method works and so far so good. So I will definitely uh, give you guys update on this pineapple and see how well it grows and hopefully it lasts for a very long time. So until then, thank you for watching my videos everyone. Bye. <music>